all right so the sub account setup is complete and as you can see I am in the sub account level right now I can switch back by clicking here switch to agency view I just want to see the sub account level right now so I can show you the features that you will see in the sub account level so I'm in the dashboard as you can see there's a bunch of data here which is empty because we just set it up if we go to the conversations area here you will find all the messages including emails text messages if you connect your Facebook page and Instagram profile those messages will come in here too and if you have the app you can you can communicate with those leads and move forward with those conversations using the conversations area so this is really powerful it lets you keep every everything like all the conversations in one place calendars will hold all the appointment bookings it will sh show you your schedule and show you all the calendars right now you can see there's empty so uh, in one of the next videos we will create calendars which will show here and here you will find all the bookings that have come in on in that calendar so moving on contacts so here you will find all the leads you can filter them uh, based on where they came from when they came based on their tags their address state city blah 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 and so on so this this is the place where you will see all the contacts or leads that will come into the system so moving on opportunities is one of the most important things in go high level opportunities are the leads which will be displayed here based on how we want to view it so I will discuss this on a separate video because this will get more confusing if I if I try to explain it shortly so I, I will need to explain this with an example so yeah payments will this 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 section will have all the invoices and payments and um, marketing is for the social planner so this is a new feature in go high level that they introduced maybe two months ago uh, so you can schedule your social media posts as you can see here facebook instagram google my business linkedin and so on you can create email campaigns email templates this has also got uh, an email builder so you can use that too templates will hold email and sms templates so if you are trying to have a conversation with them just to save time you can use this area templates uh, you can create some pre-written templates that you can just copy and paste over uh, in, the, in the conversations trigger links this is uh, a bit advanced feature which uh, which will be discussed in a in a separate video automation this part has workflows so workflows are basically the automations that we are going to create like what what will happen if somebody uh, fills up a form what will happen if somebody books a calendar where do they go what emails do they receive do they receive reminders do they receive confirmations and all sorts of stuff we will create in automation so we will we are gonna spend so much time with automation and opportunities so these are the two most important things and then there's sites so sites will hold all the funnels all the websites that you create uh, you'll create in go high level also there's a chat widget thing you you can see you can integrate this with your own WordPress or Wix website or or the website that you if you want to create a website in go high level you can also use that chat widget in that website too there's as you can see uh, there's a feature called blogs so as you can see from the name blogs are the area where you will upload blogs and integrate with your website memberships this is the uh, this is the, the courses area so you can you can create a membership area for your clients or customers you can sell online courses using this you can create as you can see the uh, products is the section where you can create online courses forms surveys so forms are basically forms which which will be like uh, which can be integrated to your landing page or your websites similarly surveys are multi-step forms so they they are forms but they are consisted into 
different steps. So moving on, reputation reporting. These are reputation is the, the review management thing. Feel free to use it if you if you like it. So but uh, yeah, reporting will contain all the Google ads report, Facebook ads, all sorts of attribution report from the system call reporting yeah you can use the call reporting if you have a lot of like uh, uh if you have agents working under you so this will come in handy and basically that's it these are some of the most important things you need to learn which we will learn together in the upcoming videos that'd be all see you in the next one